Hey, buddy. What's wrong? Oh, I'm sick. Yeah? So what, what can't you do? I can lay down and go and eat cornmeal. And I can have your pillow for so I can lay. And what do you I'm, eat? I think I'm getting the apple pudding and soup. And watching Frozen. I fall. Your throat? You have strep throat. Can you say strep throat? Strep throat. Nope. And it has snowed. It's been snowing all day. It actually doesn't look that bad, but now it's like sleeting. Finish it up. Tilt it back. <laughs> so I'm going to brag right now for a second. So for husband, for husband, for Valentine's Day, my husband sent me those roses and then protein chips because I never will buy them. They're expensive, but I always want them because... I never have, like, a protein snack that's, like, salty, so I like those. And I had told him that I wanted this, so he got it for me for Valentine's Day, Donuts and Deadlifts, the hoodie. Let me show you the back, too. That's the back. I'm obsessed with it. I love it. He's so freaking cute. Hey guys, I'm in such a better mood than I was on last week. Um, so tonight, I totally switched gears. Instead of doing squats or deadlifts, which are due, I should be doing them, I did bench because that's what was free. People were all over the squat racks. Um, so I did bench and um, some other upper body work and pull-ups. I'm working, I was working really hard to um, get less and less assistance. Yeah, um, let me show them that you, what we got, okay? Um, so, and then we went to the grocery store. And I'm gonna do grocery haul because that's what I do. All right, so if you care, we got Davey some milk. We got these snacks for him. Oops, he already has yogurt, which he always has on hand. We also got these granola bars and cheese sticks. I'll probably, if I really want a snack, I'll eat those too. And we got him a new toothbrush, right? Because um, he had strep and needs to replace his toothbrush. Um, yeah, give me two seconds, okay, baby? Um, so then for lunches, I have seriously been loving doing this. I could prep meals or, you know, stop being lazy and make my salad, but... These are so good, and what I do is I use like half the dressing, and if I need it, which I don't a lot of times, I'll add some vinegar that I love. Then this is like my godsend too. It's so good. I always say, I don't know if it's so good because I don't have to do any of the work and cook it, but honestly, it has really good flavor. So I add that to my salads, and that's my lunch for the week because I'm trying to go really low carb during the day. Um, and then I made, I picked out two dinners for me and David that'll probably last two nights each. So I got high fiber, low carb tortillas. I have ground turkey that I need to cook with this seasoning. And I'm gonna serve it with sauteed peppers and onions, pico de gallo and spinach. And then um, my second meal, which I'll probably cook on Friday and have all weekend, is um, this beef stew. So I got, once again, seasoning, broth, onion, some potatoes, carrots. I'll add in some spinach at the end and this really bloody beef so I'm going to keep it in the back and that's it I'm going to do a full day of eating tomorrow because I need to stay accountable because I'm seeing my hubby in two weeks and not that he cares but it's just sort of a goal to work towards you know um lose weight try and lose some weight by then yeah hey guys why is my hair like that I always throw it all the way to one side what's up so now I'm sick I woke up feeling terrible <laughs> I haven't like eaten anything all day, so I did not do a full day of eating, and I know I'm going to wake up tomorrow and not be able to swallow, so. I got this today in the mail. I think my husband sent it to me. I don't know. I haven't been able to reach him, but I had no clue if he was sending to me. I don't know. But either way, I'm super excited to try it. I've seen Buff Bag on Instagram a lot, and it looks so good. Chocolate chip, protein, peanut, peanut spread, chia and flaxseed which I love the both of those. This is going to be insane in my oatmeal. The ingredients are really, really good, too. So let's try this out. Sorry, I look like crap. I feel like it. So there's the consistency. It's really great that I'm, like, filming this over top of my laptop. I like the consistency. It looks like probably the chia and flaxseed. It looks like brownie batter. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I need something to drink. 
You want to try it? It's peanut butter. Chocolate peanut butter. Peanut butter. Can't kill me. Here, baby. Ah. No, it's not. Try it. Is it good? Do you like it or no? Yes. Does anyone else come into cardio in the morning and feel like they're one of the old folks walking on the treadmill in the gym? So my oatmeal looks as good as I thought it would. I did my usual steel cut oats with um, half a scoop of this chocolate nut protein powder from my protein. I mixed in a little bit of light organic brown sugar. Um, a little bit of the oop buff bake chocolate chip protein peanut spread. Um, and of course, I love, even though this already has chia and flax, I like to add some of this. It's like crunchy and really good. And half a banana. All right, so it's lunchtime and I'm having my usual salad. I did the Southwestern one. So instead of chicken, which I usually add to my salads, I added the some of the ground beef or ground turkey actually from yesterday's dinner and some of the pepper and onion mixture that was like the fajita stuff. So it's going to be good. It is so much. A lot of times I don't finish these salads and I save them, but yeah. I wanted to tell you guys what I have for snacks because I'm about to eat one. It's like 2.30 in the afternoon. Um, this is probably going to be my only full day of eating for a while because it's probably going to be pretty similar to this for a while now. Um, I think I mentioned it, but uh, I wanted to elaborate here. So basically the next two weeks, probably more, um, I'm going to be extremely strict with my diet and also do a lot more cardio, which freaking sucks, but I have a timeline. Uh, I'm going to see my husband in a few weeks and I want to lose some weight. Uh, obviously, I, I feel like I need to give a disclaimer, like obviously he doesn't care and I'm not losing it for him, but he hasn't seen me for a month, it'd be kind of cool. I mean, he used to see me every day, so it's hard to notice if someone's, like, lost some weight or, you know, made progress if you see them every single day. So maybe we'll see if he can notice it. And it's always nice to feel like you're trying to look good for your husband. Why not? But honestly, what I'm really doing it for me, it's just nice to sort of set a little goal. Um, I don't want to do, you know, I'm going to always maintain a healthy lifestyle. I plan on doing that for the long term, but um, I, th I know that I can be strict and throw in more cardio that I hate for just like if I know it's a shorter time period. So we're just going to see if I can make any progress. But basically, um, for breakfast, I'm going to keep eating my oatmeal. That's been satisfying me a, really a lot. <laughs> I've been loving it. Uh, I've also been loving having my salads with some added protein, usually the pre-made grilled chicken. Um, and then at night, I make a dinner for me and my son. It usually is a dinner that lasts two nights, so we eat it the next day, and it's usually low carb. Um, <coughs> then I go to the gym, and after the gym, if I am hungry, I'll have half a scoop of protein as an actual shake, which I rarely do, but I'm going to do that because otherwise um, it's really easy to late at night, like binge and everything. So if I'm hungry, I'm going to put a little protein in my body, especially right after I lift. Um, if I'm not, I might also have, I've been loving oranges, so that's something else I might eat before when I get back from the gym, uh, but I'm also going to try not to eat too much late at night because that's when I just start eating more than I need. So right now, like I said, it's 2.30. I'm going to have a snack now. I got, my husband got me a bunch of these protein chips from Quest. They're sour cream and onion, but I think I like the barbecue the most. Um, and I really like salty snacks. That's always been a problem for me. Like protein bars aren't my favorite, you know, because um, I want like a salty snack. So those I think they're pretty good. They're, they're, they don't taste like, like, they're not as flavorful as regular chips, but they satisfy my craving. And then these are like sweet and salty nature value bars, and it says it's protein, 10 grams of protein, gluten-free, peanut, almond, dark chocolate. They're supposed to be for my son, but if I'm craving it, I'll have that, along with his cheese sticks. Once again, they're supposed to be for him, but it's, sometimes I crave cheese, so. And then the last thing that I sometimes snack on in the afternoon, um, is this Dannon Light and Fit Greek yogurt. I feel like everyone knows that these have great uh, great macros. It's 80 calories, 12 grams of protein, and I really, really love this flavor. It is raspberry chocolate. It's so good. It tastes like pudding. And like I said, I never used to crave sweet stuff, but now I do, and this is so good. So it, it definitely fulfills any sweet cravings. 
Um, I think I might actually have both of these right now for my afternoon snack, um, or I guess meal three, I should say, uh, because I would probably only have one or the other if I knew I were going to have more carbs for my dinner, but tonight I'm just going to have like a taco salad, not have the tortillas. Even though the tortillas are low carb, high fiber, and carbs aren't the devil, um, I am trying to go low carb. So I think I'll still have this as my snack. Um, and yeah, basically for this diet, my goals are to stop eating desserts and like, you know, anything like that. This, this obviously is, has, is sweet, but, um, you know, desserts, cookies, anything that I don't need because I never used to. Ice cream, why am I eating ice cream now? Um, and then go low carb for the most part. Obviously, I think oatmeal is great, a great filling breakfast in the morning, but uh, I am going low carb and just stop snacking so much without like thinking about it. So those are my goals combined with cardio, upped cardio. Uh, I think I'll see how it goes. So for dinner, I'm literally just eating the ground turkey with taco seasoning, peppers and onions, and a little bit of feta in there. I should have added spinach, but I really don't feel like it, so whatever. What the hell? My husband has not stopped buying me stuff. And I feel obligated to show you guys when he sends me, like, fitness stuff because it's fun. Um, he really didn't have to do this. He just... Um, if any of you guys have a family member or loved one in the military, you know what I mean by this is like the only perk of him being away and active duty right now, if you know what I mean. I'm not going to say anything else, but he just wanted to spoil me, I guess. So he got me my favorite. I told him the exact kind I like from Old Navy, the exact kind. It's the Old Navy Active Go Dry. I usually like the cropped ones, but... um and I usually like high-waisted, but I, he got me the black ones that I had mentioned to him, and then he got me something else, too, which I love the black ones. Like, I wear them all the time, so I needed another pair, or I really wanted another pair, because I honestly, like, wash my leggings all the time. And then he got me this pair. Oh, wow, it actually looks like, whoa, I've never seen this pair. It actually looks like they're high-waisted and cropped. I've had, there's usually not that many, like, shade options or styles that are high-waisted and cropped, um, which it looks like these are. Wow, they're really cute. Oh my god, I freaking love him. I can't believe he did that. So, I spent more money. I got two things from Ulta tonight. I got, what, buddy? Okay. So, I got It Cosmetics Hello Light, the cream illuminator. I'm literally sitting crawling on my counter to get a picture of this stuff, too. It's, okay, come on, come on. It is really cool um, consistency. It's almost like a cream to powder finish. It's really pretty, and I love the texture. <clears throat> then I got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer. This is what it looks like. It's, like, rectangular. I guess it's triangular and has a spoolie. Good morning. I'm up early today only because I told myself I can do deadlifts this morning. So it got my ass out of bed. <laughs> um, but I am um, doing deadlifts in the morning because I haven't been able to do deadlifts or like squats for real in so long. Last night I did squats on the Smith machine only. Um, it's just like my gym is way too crazy and there's not enough equipment. So I'm looking into, seriously looking into a powerlifting gym now. <laughs> <laughs> 